All right, guys, welcome back to another YouTube video. Today, we're once again playing some Ash top lane. We're running into, I think, the Aurelia matchup. And for the wins, we got Arcane Comet and Manaflu, Transcendent Scorch. We got Biscuits and then also Approach Velocity. Unfortunately, these guys are lane swapping right now. They actually uh, wanted to play Urgot top lane, and apparently, they're now putting Urgot in mid lane to counter my mid laner. And then they put Aurelia top lane to counter me. That's interesting. Anyway, it should be okay though. Aurelia is a mega counter to me. Like, Aurelia is a really hard matchup. But I'm Ash. I win everything here. I got this. I feel very confident about this. Ooh. Nice one. I feel confident about the matchup. I know how to win this one. It's just that, like, it's very hard to actually trade Aurelia in most of the cases because she has a, a very easy way to all in name. And obviously her all-in is way better than mine. Because she's always able to get into melee range. So. It's gonna be a tough one. But we'll uh, we'll figure it out. We can like wave in some auto attacks here. Alright. Not bad. We're getting her low to a certain point. She has to make a choice right now to what she's up to. What is she actually up to? Wait a second. She's gonna backport. Or not? It's not backport. Now here comes the hardest part of the lane. The wave is now gonna start slow pushing into Aurelia and that gives her a free opportunity to all in me at any given moment. So. We have a little bit of trouble here. And we have also no vision, so we're, uh, <laughs> we're gonna have a bad time. She's gonna all in me. She's gonna all in, no doubt. She will all in me. Look at this, look at this. I'm gonna bait. I have fiddlesticks all the way. Look at this, look at this. Oh, that's such a bad timing. Oh, come on, man. All right. <laughs> At least we get both. At least we get both, man. That's all right. At the very least, we get both. And I really only got like one of them. So that's that's pretty good. All right. She will hit level five because the, I'm losing a massive wave. Yeah, I might need some ganks again. Yes, she's level 5. This is not good for me. Yeah, we'll just let her push. I can't, like, get into auto attack range. It's a bit too tough for me, so... Let's just play it safe. Gotta rely probably a bit on fiddlesticks this game, maybe. What's she building though? She's going for a lifesteal. I wonder if she actually gets to make some decent use out of this. Uh, pretty soon enough, our W is going to, you know, lower in cooldown as you put more points into it. An enemy has been slain. And. Hopefully, that's going to allow me to, like, try and get her low. That's my plan, at least. But yeah, she does have lifesteal now. So, I guess it's safe to say she's trying to... I hope she doesn't want to, like, dive me under tower. That would be a problem for me. Yeah, she's got a reset for item advantage. That's very bad for me. But I don't think that she can get a longsword. Now, I think she can get a longsword from that. But I don't think that she can get a pickaxe from it. So I should be good to go. Okay. Let's do a slow push. I'm letting my jungler know that our valley is going to all in me at any second right now. This is where it's going to be really tough. Oh, 
Hopefully we can get a kill right here. Seems like Zed is also top lane, so we have a bit of a a little bit of a problem. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Let's go! Ash arrows doing the job, man. We have a problem. <laughs> Ash, top lane. Let's go. <laughs> Seems like we're being ganked. Ash top lane. Let's go, man. We have vision everywhere. <laughs> Look at this. We always know where my, where the enemy jungler is. We got all tools we need, man. We got it all. No problem. Got it. Uh, wait a sec. I'm just gonna go for a potion just in case I'm getting all lent by Aurelia and I need to save myself somehow. Okay. Got my ult in 25. I can see the devil's nice. appeal, but alas, I've thrown my chips in with the choir. <clears throat> I wonder if Zed is like camping top lane. I hope I'm. Uh, I hope he isn't. I'm just gonna make sure I just stay close to the wall just in case. Okay. Yeah, there is a chance. Oh yeah, right. Yeah, Aurelia actually went for the for the voids. Okay. So I think that Zed is also top lane, I guess, because I don't think that Aurelia would do it by herself. I don't think so. Very much doubt it. Nice. My W is like uh, getting pretty low cooldown right now. Do like a slow push. This is where things will get very difficult. Because Aurelia only wants one thing, right? She just wants to all in me, and that's it. Yeah, I can't fight like this. Aurelia is a massive counter. This is why. It's basically unplayable. <gasps> What? How did that land though? <laughs> How did that land? <laughs> Explain that to me, bro. <laughs> the Aurelia ultimate just like teleported on me. <laughs> what do you mean? Right, spaghetti code, bro. I'm telling you. It's the, the best one I've seen today. I'm gonna hold it. Now oh, nice. I actually got to hit it. I'll slow push. <clears throat> yeah, I can tell that, like, this Aurelia knows. He knows that it's all about one all in. That's, like, all it takes, and then I go down. There's literally nothing that I can do about that. This is, like,. This is how the matchup works. I can't change that. Aurelia is the champion for matchups like this. So I I basically use all my spells to like survive it. It's unfortunate because I needed ghost here, but yeah, I'll li I'll try and live without it. We have fiddlesticks on top lane, so maybe maybe we can make it work. Who knows? <clears throat> Okay, here we go. Uh, maybe we can dive that stuff. Oh, I didn't get to hit my W here just when I have to. Nice. Incredible. What a nice dive. Love that stuff. Okay. Oh, is that his top lane again? There's no way I live. Nice. 
What a solid Soraka ultimate, man. Oh, there's actually a teleport, so I'm gonna have to run. Okay, I'm gonna ask my jungler if he can save my plates for me. <clears throat> Sell that. Let's go for this. Okay. Unstoppable. Yeah, I don't know if Fiddlesticks can save it anymore. I don't think so. Yeah, seems like we're uh, seems like we're getting wrecked by Urgot too right now. So we're oh oh Oof. what? <laughs> How did they not kill my fiddlesticks? How? Okay, got him. So yeah, we're in a uh, massive counter matchup, and we're still, still winning. Fortunately, there's a lot of things you can do, in Nash. Love the, love the way how you can like set up the top lane. It's very nice. <clears throat> okay. We still have a problem, though. I know that what Zed is capable of. I can't get the plate, because if I walk forward, I'm going to int. I know that Arveldi is going to look to all in me, so... I'll have to avoid it. I unfortunately cannot get the plate. <clears throat> we are super fed already. Still, though, Arveldi is still capable of all inning me. So we'll have to continue to play safe like this for a while. Dominating. Hmm. Just gonna walk away. Okay, I'm getting the last. That's there. You go. I think that she's probably gonna push another one out. Yeah. Yeah. I'll, j I'll just pretend like I'm gonna walk away, and I'll just let her push, and then I'll last it again, so I can avoid like fighting Aurelia, because I know th I know what she's looking for currently. Got it. Okay. I don't know if I can get my reset. I think she's going to keep on pushing this out infinitely. I wish I could fight her really, uh, like, at a moment like this. We could in, uh, technically build into Trinity. I'll just take it from here. Nice. I assume that she's still here. No, not anymore. Seems like she walked away. Okay. In theory, I could have like stolen the uh, uh, the kill with my ultimate. <laughs> I could have done it. Yeah, they go for a surrender immediately. All right, guys, welcome back, part two. This time we're playing Ash top lane into the uh, Volibear matchup. And for the runes, we got Lethal Tempo Triumph, we got Alacrity, we got Cutdown Biscuits, and Approach Velocity. Unfortunately, I got Triumph. I wish I had presence this game. Also, unfortunately. We are a full lady team comp, and we're running into a Ramus jungle. So, uh, this game is destined to be a loss already. <laughs> this game is a mega loss. But we'll see how hard we can carry it. Maybe, maybe we can absolutely 1v9 it. Uh, despite playing as Ramus full AD comp. We'll see, we'll see if we can. Chances are very hard against us, but we'll figure it out. We have literally no champion that can beat Ramus, so... Our late game is not looking very good currently. Alright, Volibear matchup is a pretty good one, though. I've actually taken Lethal Tempo. I actually don't have the uh, Arcane Comma this time. 
Not gonna auto him as much yet. I need to get the wave in a uh, more solid position. Picks up the shield, sure. All right, I'll pick up my E as well. I could throw it here, try and get some autos in. Oh, what? Like an instant flash? It's the first thing he does is flash. Wow, that's insane. I guess he got really tilted. <laughs> <laughs> okay, man. Where's your cover? Let's see if we can get some damage in here. He's got no flash anymore. Which means I can do whatever I want to. What? Wait. Was that like spaghetti code right there? Because my W did not do any damage. Clearly did not do any damage. I'm pretty sure it didn't. Okay. Nice. I'm very happy already. Let's go for the Tyrone boots here. No, no, just go for the, the potion. Nice. Okay, and we're gonna go back top land. Seems like he also went for Terrible Boots, so I'm so glad that I already uh, bought it. Very good. Heaven is empty and all the angels I'm very dead. worried about Ramus. I know that the late game is gonna be unplayable. I know it. We have no champion that can beat Ramus. I know it in the back of my mind. I hope that, like, somehow we can win this before Ramus becomes a true problem. But he's already building armor, so... <laughs> Things are not looking very good. Wait, I'm gonna try and hold this. <clears throat> nice. He's yeah. got no flash still. Keep holding it. This is the perfect position, in my opinion. Okay, hold it again. Same like before. Make sure that he never gets to do anything. This is being a slow tear. I think he'll probably get away. He needs to help me shut this out. Okay, I'll try and oh, he's actually still here. Incredible! Let's go, man. I'm surprised. Ah, oh, he actually lost the Q there. Incredible. He's gonna lose a lot of farm from this now. Okay, this is awesome. This was solid, man. This was really good. Uh, let's go ahead and go for Berserker's Greaves here. Uh, things are going to be a little bit uh, more difficult right now because... Uh, Volibear is about to get the flashback. And on top of that, his ultimate allows him to dash onto me very easily and if he actually hits the full combo i will instantly get deleted so it, this is where the uh the real challenge is going to begin so like so before all these levels like it was very time. easy right that but when he gets the flash and the ultimate it becomes difficult seems like they are lane swapping they're putting silas in top lane right now and they're putting volibear in mid lane this is really interesting this is really interesting. In 
incredible. Not only did we win the entire team, uh, not team fight, did, did we win the entire fight here? But on top of that, top lane is actually being pushed in my direction. And we actually didn't lose anything. I purposely uh, actually left the, 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 the lane in this way, in this state. I saw that Silas like pushed in uh, like one or two last hits. So we just lost like an entire wave and I didn't lose anything. So not only did we win all that stuff here, but we also completely win top lane through all of the gold and XP. We're going to be really far ahead on Silas right now. And we need that desperately for this matchup. Very good. This is actually... Th this is going to change everything, like, completely for me. Again, I'm... Nah, I'm not going to hold it. I'll just, like, get on our tower this time. Because Cybus is looking to all in me, and if he actually hits the ability against me, I will actually take too much damage. I think I would probably, like, lose, like, 50% of my health bar, uh, which would put me in an awful position. So, prefer not, please. Right. So the problem about Silas is that again, like Silas is a uh, really, uh, really good like assassin mage. Actually, completely, perfectly designed for me, I guess. Like, it's really hard to play it out. I can't play this out. I know that if the ability hits, I'm gonna have a terrible time. Yeah. Goodbye. I'm not looking to go for a fight here. Because I know that I will end up losing it entirely if I go for it. So I'll just see if I can back off. Okay, let's go for the pickaxe here. I'm not going to buy any wards or, or potions right now. I don't care about that. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe my jungler can actually fight him. If I can hit my arrow from a mile away, we can actually uh, kill him for free. Ah, oh, he's backing. Never mind. Okay, we push this as quickly as we can. Nice. Ram is stop lane. So I'm going to try and move as quickly as I can. This might be a pretty bad fight, by the way. Hmm. Wait, I guess we can find him. Uh, we were going to be farming some plates here. Try it out. I'll let Thurgood go top if he wants. Okay. What? So is it? They're lane swapping again! They're now putting Silas in mid lane and they're putting uh, Volibear in top lanes because I'm walking mid lane so they lane swap as well. <laughs> Man, these guys are lane swapping everywhere wherever I go. They're actually lane swapping so much. They really want the Volibear to like face off the Urgot, I guess. <laughs> and my Urgot is still beating him. Like even if they lane swap, let's go, man. That's exactly what we need right now. <laughs> Unfortunately for them. Too bad. I was expecting her turn, but he didn't. Okay, we also got the plate here. And we go back. Let's uh, go ahead. We're going to go for Blade of the uh, Blade Throne King. And then we're going to go into the Hurricane for the next item. And Hurricane is a very important item in this game. It is because... Um, Hurricane allows me to like wave clear top mid jungle all at the same time 
uh, being able to speedrun everything basically and hopefully getting me a lead through farming as well. Um, of course, I have uh, kill pressure right here as you can see, but I want to use Hurricane to snowball the game even further. Uh, so I can reach the mid game uh, being too strong rather than reaching the late game. I don't want to reach the late game this game because I know we're going to lose the late game with the Rambus on the enemy team. There's no way we are going to beat him. Uh, I guess we can maybe dive like under tower, I guess. Nice. I have a problem. I can't fight him. Welcome to Rama's life. I think that this is going to be probably the most frustrating game I will ever get to play. I, I know in my brain that this late game is completely unplayable and I can already sense it like when I face off Ramus by myself. I know I can't fight him. We have no one that can. Like you could see it there. I can't auto him. I will just the, the damage will reflect on me like immediately, and there's nothing that I can do. I can't I can't kite him either. Let's push this. I'm just gonna repeat the same thing all over again. Let's go. Yeah, he's dead. Nah, no surrender. He'll play this out. Hmm, they're probably gonna look for us. I'm afraid you'll find heaven is empty. Sorry. Yeah, we can we can definitely try it out. I think Ramus is also here. I wish I can auto Ramus, man. I wish I could. Unfortunately, my W went the other direction after flashing, so that didn't work out very well. An ally has been slain. Nice. I don't even think I can defend top lane right now in this state. So is that it, uh, pushing? Hmm, doesn't seem to want to fight me here, Just, that's nice. Just keep autoing the wave, I need to sustain back up. Solid. Okay, I need like uh actually I can already buy it, so here we go. Let's get my hurricane. I don't care. Like I know that this late game is completely unwinnable. I know it is. I know that Ram is gonna be unkillable at some point. I don't care though, I'm gonna play this out. I don't care, like I'm gonna give it a try. I believe, I highly believe in the 1% that we could maybe turn this. It's extremely unlikely, but 
It's still worth trying out. Probably Dragon is a pretty bad idea because I just don't want to face up Ramus. Uh, if nah, follow your section on top lane, I do have to stay with my team here. If we can magically win that team fight, it is actually winnable. I can't auto Ramus. Impossible. Uh, no team fighting ever. Team fighting. We cannot team fight. We just can't. The Ramos will continue to reflect damage. I can't auto him. I wonder like if anyone can even auto him at this point. If I can't auto him, then probably no one can. Maybe like an Urgot ultimate could probably do it, or maybe like a Kane combo could get him low to a certain point, but that's really it. We could try going for this item very specifically, uh, which gives me more opportunity to like auto Ramos. But again, like we still have the same issue afterwards. That issue will not go away. Maybe Wits End. But uh, I think it's safe to say this item is the best thing we can do. Your team has destroyed and ally has been slain. I don't want to go top lane right now. Not yet. I want to see if someone's going to walk there first. Hmm. I don't know if the CC is going to do anything. Really good, like, Ash arrow, right? Let's go. Uh, Volibear's back top lane. Got no some spells. They're gonna have to back off. Yeah, so far we're able to turn a match around. To some degree. Let's walk away here. Got no interest. Yeah, let's uh, start building into the next item. I'll, I'll go for the Harpo next for now. And we go back mid. I need to try and somehow land another ultimate. We got Urgot in bot lane. He wants me to get the red buff. Okay. Incredible! Let's go! This Ramus was trying to get... He was trying to taunt me and I just kept walking out of the taunt range. He couldn't actually hit me. And we actually just won because of it. Nice. <laughs> We're doing the, like, unthinkable, man. We're doing the unthinkable. Even though it's like a massive ultra counter game, we still we still turn around. In, the, in fact, we're getting the Baron buff right now. Insane, dude. We're not supposed to win these. There's a fight right now. And my teammates are also turning this fight. This couldn't be any better, bro. The enemy team are, 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 are just inting at this point. Very good. Okay. 
Okay, let's go back. Let's go, dude. We're able to turn this game around. I think I'm probably going to go into... Um, I can't do this anymore because I already have this item. So what I'm probably going to do is I'll, um, I'll be building BT. Flashed on me. I'll play, buddy. Oh, come on, this is my attack, bro. All right, man. It happens. I love how that team fight was played out. I wish I could have had the extra auto on the other guy. I wish there was no teleport, actually. But yeah. Uh, let's go for... Uh, we've got to make a tough choice right now. Either we go for more damage. Or we go for BT. The thing is, we already have so much attack speed. I would really like to have this item as a fourth item. I would really like to have this item. Can go for both. The thing is, I already have so much attack speed. Enemy rampage. And I got, uh, I got my lethal tempo. Record, you are all okay, let's go for the, let's go for the life steal. Let's try again. No, I can't focus Ramas. I can't auto. I can't auto him. I can't. I can't auto him. This is what Ramas does. That's the thing about Ramas. There's no way I can uh, fight against them. <laughs> Oh man. Project, thank you so much for the five sub gifts, bro. Thank you so much, Project. Thank you so much for like supporting me and also like gifting the subs for other people. That is awesome. Hmm. If Jin stays in bot lane, I'm gonna try it out. I've, oh, okay, never mind. They can see where I am, so that's not gonna work. This is a beautiful Unfortunately. Oh, let's pick up the red buff. We really have to try, consider going for another team fight. No one's here. Wait. <laughs> yeah, I'm running from that, bro. <laughs> I'm not gonna get ramused. <laughs> Look at him charging everything on me. <laughs> yeah, not happening. <laughs> Apparently they had like so much vision there. Wait, 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 I have an idea. Let's go. This is it. Let's get their entire base down while we can. 
Ah, uh, Ram is already following. He's looking for me. Look. Ah. Uh, unfortunately. There's no red buff either. I think I got a problem. that against me oh yo that side is he did such an such a good one man he actually nearly got me there oh solid dude I need my teammates to push mid lane next before the dragon spawns in like 34 seconds. So the idea is to like uh, push mid lane, give them the dragon, and then we just end. Because I think they're going to try and prioritize for the dragon, I guess. I don't know. Uh, Kaden doesn't follow. So my idea is straight up not going to work. We go to Ramus again. Okay. Tough one. They're gonna go dragon, so I'm gonna try and like. I'll, I'll try and finish. Delaying it. Finish! Come on! Oh! We're winning the game! Against the Ravis team! Wait, what's Mario got doing? Oh! We won the game! <laughs> Full lady team comp into a Ravis and we actually win the game. I told you guys, man. Surrendering this match would have been a mistake. Nice. Hey, either way, this is Ash Top Lane. Thank you so much for watching part two. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.